Hi, and welcome to the NC Libraries tutorial on how to find stuff to borrow from the library. What stuff? We're talking about books, DVDs, and magazines. Basically anything that isn't online. To find items you can take out of the library, go to the library website and select the Books and DVDs tab from the Find It box on the library's homepage. You can choose to search for all items, or just books, or just DVDs by using the Format drop-down menu. Next, enter your carefully planned search words. You can search by keyword, author, title, subject, and more. You can also limit to just one campus library or search both at the same time. Don't worry if an item is located at the other campus. If you place a hold on it, we can have it shipped here for you in about two days. More on this to come. Once you have your search set up just the way you want it, go for it by clicking the Find It button. There are many great features on your results screen. You can find more details about a book or DVD by clicking on its title. If you found what you're looking for right away, just record the call number and head out to the library book stacks to find the book or DVD with that same number on it. If you need help figuring out the organization system, just ask the library staff member. If you didn't find what you're looking for, try using the options on the left-hand side of your screen to narrow down your search, or use different keywords. If you need any search suggestions, ask any library staff member. They're happy to help. If you're feeling especially fancy, try out the advanced search option. It allows you to combine different search terms for the ultimate in relevant results. If an item is currently checked out or located at the other campus library, you can place a hold on it. When you place a hold on an item that is located at the other campus library, we will have it shipped to your library and notify you by email when it arrives. It usually takes two to three days. If you place a hold on an item that is checked out, you will go on a waiting list for it and we will notify you by email when it's ready for you to pick up. In order to place a hold, you will need to log into your library account. You will need your seven digit student number and library PIN for access. Your library PIN is your month of birth and day of birth in numbers. For example, July 10th would be 0710. Follow the example on the screen if you forget. If you'd like to renew an item you have currently checked out, you will also need to log into your library account. You can find the link to this account at the top of your book search screen and from the library's homepage. Once you are logged in, you can view and renew anything you have checked out, take a look at any holds you have placed, Look at any lists you have created while searching for items, and check for any outstanding finds. Not that you would ever be late returning library items, right? If you have any questions or would like to learn some more search tips, drop by and ask any of the library staff. You can also call or email us. Happy researching!